The search for life beyond Earth is one of humanity's greatest quests. Now fueled by groundbreaking tools like the James Webb Space Telescope, this powerful instrument is unveiling a multitude of distant planets, from super-Earths with oceans to zombie planets that challenge our understanding of habitability. These discoveries are expanding our view of the universe and reshaping the possibilities for life beyond our world. LHS 1140b is a super-Earth in the constellation Cetus, about six times Earth's mass. Initially thought to have a thick hydrogen-helium atmosphere, recent JWST observations suggest it may instead have an Earth-like, nitrogen-rich atmosphere. This raises the possibility of liquid oceans on its surface. Tidally locked to its red dwarf star, one side of LHS 1140b is in constant daylight, while the other is in darkness, potentially creating an eyeball Earth effect. This unique climate could lead to icy regions on the dark side and liquid water on the illuminated side, creating possible niches for life. JWST has found a star system 55 light years away with three super Earths orbiting a stable orange dwarf star, increasing the likelihood of habitable conditions. One of these planets lies in the habitable zone where liquid water could exist. Additionally, the GJ667C system in Scorpius features several potentially habitable super-Earths orbiting a red dwarf star. While powerful flares may challenge life, their proximity to the habitable zone suggests they could support more resilient life forms. These discoveries suggest stable, habitable planets may be more common than previously thought. Intriguingly, JWST has also imaged celestial bodies that exist somewhere between stars and planets, so-called zombie planets. These are planetary mass objects that formed similarly to stars but didn't gain enough mass to initiate nuclear fusion. While they don't orbit a star, these zombie planets have unique characteristics that blur the lines of traditional astronomical categories. They invite speculation about entirely different forms of planetary existence, adding another layer to the diversity of objects in our galaxy. The JWST has uncovered fascinating insights into zombie galaxies, like our own Milky Way, which experiences dormancy periods without star formation. These phases help astronomers understand the life cycles and shaping forces of galaxies over billions of years, shedding light on the future potential of planetary systems. With red dwarf stars comprising over 70% of our galaxy's stars, many planetary systems with Earth-like planets may exist. One example is TOI 715b, a planet in the habitable zone of a red dwarf with conditions that could support liquid water. If confirmed, TOI 715b would be the smallest known planet in this habitable zone, advancing the search for life-supporting worlds. Not all discoveries hint at life-friendly environments, however. Some exoplanets like LTT 9779b present truly hostile conditions. Orbiting a distant star, this ultra-hot Neptune has a highly reflective metallic atmosphere that defies our understanding of planetary survival. Its clouds are composed of metal, and its scorching surface would seem to preclude any form of life as we know it. Another dramatic example is WASP-76b, where molten metal rain and extreme temperatures create a scene straight out of science fiction. Tidally locked to its star, one side is perpetually bathed in heat, allowing metal to vaporize and then condense on the cooler dark side, a phenomenon unique to this scorching world. Then there's the HD 11000067 system, where six sub-Neptune planets revolve in synchronized orbits. 
This remarkable rhythmic resonance, rarely found in the cosmos, has remained stable for over a billion years, offering a cosmic orchestra that could hold fascinating insights into planetary evolution and stability. Such systems reveal the diversity and unpredictability of planetary structures, challenging our ideas about what configurations are possible. One of the most captivating finds involves circumbinary planets, planets that orbit two stars instead of one. The planet BOP-1C, discovered in a binary star system over a thousand light years away, exemplifies this rare class. Circumbinary planets face unique challenges due to the gravitational forces of two suns, making planetary formation more difficult, but also giving rise to a variety of possible climates and seasonal changes. Observations of water-rich atmospheres are especially exciting. GJ9827D, a twice-Earth-sized exoplanet, shows traces of water despite surface temperatures as high as those on Venus. Further studies with JWST could reveal more about water-rich atmospheres, which may prove crucial to understanding the dynamics of habitability beyond Earth. Kepler 452b, an exoplanet orbiting a sun-like star, is another key candidate. With conditions that may resemble Earth's, this super-Earth receives similar sunlight and temperature levels, although future changes in its atmosphere could lead to a runaway greenhouse effect. Astronomers have also discovered Kepler 186f, an Earth-sized planet in its star's habitable zone. Although it only receives about a third of the solar heat Earth does, Kepler 186f's atmosphere might still retain enough warmth for liquid water. Notably, its stable axial tilt suggests consistent seasons, an important factor for long-term habitability. It would take centuries to reach Kepler 186f with current technology, but its existence offers hope of discovering habitable planets closer to us in our cosmic neighborhood. Kepler-1649c, an Earth-like planet in the habitable zone of a red dwarf star, is a promising candidate for hosting life, despite concerns about flare exposure. Similarly, planets like Kepler 62e and 62f in the Kepler 62 system also show potential for habitability with possible oceans and supportive climates. While sending signals or probes remains a challenge, astronomers are hopeful that habitable planets could be found within 20 light years, potentially transforming our understanding of the universe and the diversity of life. Could each new discovery by the James Webb Space Telescope and other telescopes be bringing us closer to finding signs of life beyond Earth? Do these far-off worlds, with their varied environments, offer hope that we may one day encounter life forms vastly different from anything we've known? As humanity continues this cosmic journey, could each revelation be expanding our sense of place in the universe, fueling dreams of a future where we might communicate with distant civilizations or even explore alien worlds? Is it possible that the universe is more diverse, resilient, and filled with possibilities than we've ever imagined? We'd love to hear your thoughts. Share them in the comments below. And to stay connected with us on this journey into the unknown, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for the latest updates and thrilling explorations into space.